Our first community entrepreneurs are a couple who have given up their lives to save lives. Jason Kelly and Sarah Jane Cameron put all their savings into their charity, Scott Serves, which delivers essential medical supplies that are needed in a hurry. Taggart star Alex Norton finds out more about this heroic service. So where did the idea come from? We found out that the health boards were paying massive sums of money to taxi companies just to courier um, small packages about that were needed urgently. Not only that, we did some more digging and we found out that they were actually taking emergency ambulances sometimes off the road. We thought, well, there must be a better way. Scott Service was born as an idea at that point. The charity they founded now has a fleet of nine motorcycles and 15 part-time volunteers. Last year alone, the, the bikes and the cars were called out over 3,500 times in the year. Um, so it's, it's, it's quite a significant number. I mean, what is it exactly that you transport? So we can transport everything from kind of samples, pharmaceuticals, uh, surgical equipment, everything normally that would be needed to support a patient while they're in the unit. And I believe you also transport breast milk. A lot of people don't know you can donate milk the same as you can donate blood, tissue and organs. And if a baby's born too early or born with underlying health conditions, sometimes mum isn't able to produce on her own or some mums can't produce. Um, and donor milk is used to treat these babies. It's very much used as a, as a medicine almost. Their milk donor service now covers all of Scotland's 16 NHS baby intensive care units. Before that, it was a postcode lottery. If, you're, if your child happened to be born in Aberdeen, for example, and it needed this donor breast milk, there was no way of getting it there. It just wasn't going to get it. So not only have we improved the service by making it a speedier delivery, we've also improved patient care by getting it out of Glasgow and to other areas. How are you doing? Last year, there were 75 babies uh, benefited from donor breast milk that they wouldn't have benefited otherwise if, if the bikes hadn't been on the road. OK, see you next time. Right. Thanks very much. Bye. And how many hours in the day is the service available? 24 hours a day, 365 days of the year. We were out on Christmas Day. Yep, so. Yes, we were sitting down at a Christmas dinner and the phone went and it was an emergency situation with a, a unit needed a, a, an item transported and we down tools and off we go. Now, I understand that you made a pretty big sacrifice to get this service up and running. I actually was very naughty and, and gave up my wedding money um, to buy the first vehicle to get Scott Serves on the go. Yeah. I'd like to point out that he hadn't actually asked me at that point. He just went away and did it. <laughs> my, my, my gran had left me some money. She'd, she'd left me a, a little sum of money. It was only about £3,000 um, to, to get married. That was her wish. I think your granny would have been proud of you. <laughs> well, that's why this one's called Ruby, because that's her, my gran's name. So that's, that's why this bike's named in memorial. They've given up so much of their lives for no money, and nothing other than the love and the, and the joy of what they're doing and the goodness of their hearts. It's a, it's a, it just inspires you. <laughs>